Hi, my name is Ed. As a licensed electrician, I do a lot of residential and light commercial work that requires me to install time switches. Today I'd like to show you how to wire the new Reliance Control 601 single pole single throw 120 volt time switch to control the outdoor landscape lighting for a private home. Before you begin any wiring, always disconnect the power at the circuit breakers. Merely turning the time switch on or off will not keep you safe from electrical shock. As you open the time switch, refer to the wiring instructions on the inside of the door. They are a permanent record of how to wire and operate the switch. To begin wiring this time switch, you'll need to gently pry these open. I really like this swing open safety door. One, it protects you. Another, it stays where it needs to be and doesn't get lost or thrown in the trash. For this wiring, I'll be using 14-2 Romex with ground, with black being the hot wire, white being the neutral, and a bare copper for the ground. I'll be running the wires for the power supply on the left hand side through the knockout, and on the knockout on the right is your lighting or the load. Here's how to wire a single pole, single throw time switch for 120 volt operation. From the supply side, you have a hot, which is your black, which goes on L1. The neutral, or the white, goes on the neutral terminal. The ground gets spliced in with the other grounds. On the lighting, or the load side, you take the black to your L1 out, the white, which is your neutral, to the terminal marked N, and the ground to the same wire nut as the ground from your supply side. The two ground wires get connected under a wire nut with a pigtail leading up to the ground terminal screw. The terminals are clearly marked, which makes wiring much easier. Now that we've made all of our terminations, we can close the safety door till it snaps and close the outside door till it snaps and lock if needed. Now turn the breaker back on and you're ready to go. And here's your finished installation.